What's going on everybody? Tyler and Nora here, Team Zombillies in the ScareFactor.com. Join us here on this gloomy night. Yeah, you, you can see the clouds up here, but that's not real thunder. That's the thunder from this building. You can look up there every once in a while. They got little lightning strobes going off up there. Very cool. This is Jackson's Underworld up here, Jackson, Michigan. Very cool looking old building here. They're advertising two different attractions, four stories tall. So we're excited to see what they got going on there. They got, look back here, they got Skelly's climbing the building. Another one right there. All kinds of cool uh, decor and stuff going on out here. I see a bunch of spider webs all over the railing up by the door kind of getting a lot of old school vibes out of this one kind of cool to see uh, what their take on uh, some old school scares are so uh, it might blow us away it might not be old school it might have all kinds of gizmos and gadgets in there we've never been here before um, actually we have but it was back in like 2011 and it was during the off season for the MHC bus tour Midwest Honors Convention so I'm sure a lot has changed in the past 10 years and we're getting ready to figure out what those changes are. No more thunder. And we have a sign they got out front there, very cool. Here's some of that railing and stuff. Their big uh, sign out in front of the door here. There it is. Tickets are inside there. Get you another view of this building. Some kind of company, old company sign up top there. Such a cool building. Let's go see what's inside. So when you come in, you come all the way up the stairs to the very top. You got all these big clown guys, big murals and stuff all over the place here. Kind of greeting you to the ticket booth. Oh, we still got more to go. Upward we go. <laughs> we just got our picture taken with some creepy actresses. A little photo up there at the top of the stairs. Big tall ceilings. So they got like some little props. Got one of the big uh, hands there. You climb up behind it and you can take selfies in front of it. Looks like the big monster's grabbing you. Pretty cool. It's got yeah, the little distortions. They're made by a company called Distortions. They're little people, kind of cool. Oh, they do have restrooms up here at the top of the stairs. Got some other little booth over there. Pretty cool looking uh, top of the stairs here. Little sign about ticket prices. VIP for only 15 more. We'll get you right in. All right, so there you got uh, two different attractions for sure. One of them is Jackson's Underworld. The other one is uh, like a, kind of a clowny 3D type of attraction. Uh, they do recommend if you're not doing VIP to probably go into the 3D one first. You can kind of burn a few minutes and usually Jackson's is a little bit shorter. But uh, we're doing VIP, so we're just gonna go ahead and do the 3D one first still. Go ahead and report on that one, and then we'll come back and do the Jacksons. They say that one's more extreme, so we'll save the best for last and uh, see what's going on. Got out of the first one. Very interesting. The lots of 3D paint, uh, blacklight reactive paint, that kind of thing, and it dumps you back out into this little gift shop midway type of area. They got another photo op done here, and then a whole other, uh, like say the gift shop area where you can buy a bunch of shirts and all that kind of thing. Very cool. Uh, a lot of interesting uh, themes and concepts up there in the 3D area. They got like Alice in Wonderland, a real trippy, like the vines hanging down in lights. That was kind of cool. Uh, worked really well with the 3D glasses. Uh, 
obviously a lot of clowns. Uh, they got a couple of like uh, picador maze type of sections. Kind of interesting, very cool. Lots of good artwork, really. Uh, some of it's kind of graffiti type of stuff. Uh, a lot of clowns and uh, some more uh, classic horror villains that you may recognize. So yeah, uh, we're gonna head on back. So yeah, we start off upstairs and then you work your way down the levels. And I think we're back on the ground level here. So now we're gonna go back up and get in line for Jackson's Underworld and see what's going on in that haunt. So once you get out of the first haunt, if you do both of them, you get back outside here and get to look at this cool building some more. But then you do have to go all the way back around in front and reclimb the stairs, of course, to get back up to the start of the next haunt. So definitely bring your stair climbing shoes you're gonna want them. First one on is Jackson's Underworld, and the one we just did is Psycho Vision. Dun, dun, dun. second one here Jackson's underworld that's the main haunt and definitely a lot more intense than the 3d one so definitely make that one your uh, base one that you go to if you're only gonna go to one go to that one yeah. um, definitely an old-school haunt I would say but they've started sprinkling in some higher-end stuff like they've got some like big 12 foot tall monsters and stuff in there they've got some uh, pretty new animatronics in there, pretty violent ones. Uh, you never know where they're going to come from. They might come overhead. Um, that lighting is cool. And then, uh, if you're afraid of heights, this is one of the only haunts we've seen uh, very successfully target that uh, that fear of heights. Very, very cool. Uh, if Multiple you, times too. Yeah, several times. So definitely come up here, check out Jackson's Underworld, Jackson, Michigan. Tell them the Scare Factor sent you. We are going to head on out to the next haunt. Highly recommended. And until then, stay scared.